bigger, modern, and the world class. That's how the newly completed passenger terminal building of the port of Batangas can be described. Another milestone for the country's maritime sector unfold last June 14, 2022, as the Department of Transportation, together with the Philippine Ports Authority, leads the inauguration ceremony of the upgraded integrated passenger terminal building of the port of Batangas in Batangas City. With relentless dedication and commitment, the DOTR and PPA successfully completed the construction of the Phase 1 and Phase 2A of the bigger and modern Batangas Passenger Terminal Building. Kung yung noon, yung facility na yun, ilalagay mo yung mga tao na yun, lahat ng kilikili nila at singit may pawis. Uh, dito ngayon, nakaupo sila, komportable, naka-aircon, nagaantay, walang nangangamoy. Kaya kailangan, i-upgrade natin yung mga pasilidad. This 15,000 square facility features fully air-conditioned lounges and PWD-friendly facilities to offer a more convenient and comfortable sea travel for passengers. The newly renovated passenger terminal building also features modern airport-like amenities, including electronic ticketing system, water and charging stations, food and commercial kiosks, all gender restrooms, nursing room for breastfeeding moms, and multi-faith prayer rooms. If passengers need assistance, an information help desk with customer service staff ready to assist passengers 24-7. They also have dedicated clinic complete with medical staff and emergency kits and assets in case of emergency. The completed Phase 1 and 2A of the facility can accommodate up to 4,000 passengers at any given time. Meanwhile, once the construction of the Phase 2B is completed, the Batangas port will be hailed as the biggest terminal port in the country with a capacity of 6,000 passengers at any given time. The upgraded port is now capable of delivering a more efficient, seamless, safer, and convenient maritime travel to our locals and visitors, being the main gateway to the nearby island provinces in the region. These developments are also seen to further provide livelihood to Batangueños as more job opportunities will be opened and expected to usher economic and tourism growth in Calabazon. We ask around about the port's transformation, and this is what passengers have to say. Uh, malaki, napakalaki ng pagbabago. Yung konsepto nito is kaya yung parang sabi ko, is parang nasa airport tayo. So, happy ako and very proud, uh, Batangen niya, kasi nakita ko yung napakalaking pagbabago ng ating uh, pier, uh, naging mas kaya-aya at the same time, mas nagkaroon ng maayos na sistema dito. Uh, especially dito sa loob, yung mga passengers, nagkaroon ng pagkakataon na makapagpahinga ng maayos. Kasi ang lawak-lawak niya, tapos ang, 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 ang ganda, ang ganda. Oh, eh, mas maganda yung bago kasi malamig, tsaka malinis. Eh, nakikita yan naman, oh, dyan, ano, maganda yung ano, upuan. Tsaka nag entertain ng maayos yung ano. Napakaluwag, maliwalas, tsaka hindi hassle yung pagdala ng mga gamit dahil maluwag yung space. Tsaka madali makita yung kung saan gate ka lalabas. Boy, napakaganda ngayon ng ating terminal. Hindi ka pares ng araw na kung saan napakasikip at saka para bang walang social distancing ng araw. Ngayon, komportable, magandang aircon, magandang mga upuan. Tapos meron pa sila dyan board na nagsasabi kung anong oras ang boarding, Ano, hindi ka nalilito at saka kung saan ka mabubod. Ako yung nagpapasalamat sa ating presidente na sa kanya rin yatang uh, sinulong niya itong ganitong terminal para sa ating sa mga roro at sa 
para sa mga compute, commuters sa katulad ko. Maraming salamat po. The said project is funded through a public-private partnership framework under the Build 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 program with Asian Terminals Incorporated which oversee the daily operation of his newly upgraded passenger terminal building. With only a few days left before the end of the term of the Duterte administration, the Department of Transportation will continue to work and deliver more to fulfill the promise to a more convenient and comfortable life for every Filipino. What do you think about the newly upgraded Batangas Port Passenger Terminal building? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell.